The following program may contain coarse language, violence, and poorly spoken English. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello, and welcome back to Mount and Blade Warband. I am Bert the Bandit King. Well, as I mentioned previously, well, since last time, I have made two men marshal. Uh, those men being a uh, actually characters. The first one was Lord Gatlin's, the Lord of Jail Baggy, or was it Lord Stimar? Yes, it was Lord Stimar, Lord of Tilbut. Uh, he didn't really do anything with the marshal ship, so I went around and, I don't know, collected some soldiers and traded a bit. After him, I put in Lord Gatlin's, the Lord of Jail Baggy. He gathered the army after I defeated him all with the pearled one and led the army down here to Charez, which is now under attack. Before I, uh, before the bat, this assault has started, I attack several of the Saranid lords and a few deserters around Charez, and sold the prisoners to a ransom broker inside. It was rather lucrative. I would say I made at least ten thousand from the loot I took from them, as well as the prisoners I sold to the ransom broker. Now the battle started. And I'm going to join in. Let's have fun. No more holding back. I will let my lords do as they will. We'll hold back for a time. Don't want to lose too many men to their archers. We'll take out a few of the archers first. Just move up. men will take the wall. New enemies have arrived. Perfect. That'll make some room up there. I would like to bludgeon a few. Charging archers.
Everyone, follow me. We'll go down here. Alright, charge in. I'll just hold over here. Follow me, actually. I have a plan. We're going to fight them in the spawn position first. Do a little fighting in here. Some bloody prisoners on her, that. Do what we did last time. Of men holding the stairs. We'll go after their archers. We won't let their infantry hold us back. Everyone charging. There we go.
And that would be that. How many did we lose? A few, I'm sure. Yes, yeah, quite a number. You lot, hold back. They're mine. Alright, you can charge in now. Someone left. Surprising. There we are. Good job. On to the keep. You were adequate backup. And you held back enough that I could kill everyone. I like that. And Sharez is ours. I'll tell all these lords to follow me, and then I'll tell them to flee into Deary. Wait. Might actually be the ransom broker still in here. And so he is. Perfect. I'll tell them to go in here, actually. Might be more productive. Anyway, I'm going to cut away here and uh, come back a bit later. See you then. Okay, I am back. And I told my lords to go inside of Sherry's. And there's over 200 prisoners in here. So I'm going to sell them to the ransom broker. Currently I have 9 million... 39,000. We'll round it off to 40. Let's see how much I'll get for all this. Already over 10,000. Lord of Serenades. Boy, this is quite the profitable venture. I won't be able to raid the set. Charez's villages anymore, but oh well, I got a nice parting gift, and I am sure that once I take Charez for myself, I will get quite a bit of loot. Typically, I'd have told them to go to Deerim, but 
Ransom Broker happened to be right here, and I'll likely lose far fewer of these by selling them right here. Because if I do tell my lords to put out the prisoners inside of Dirim, and I happen to go to Dirim and there's no Ransom Broker, by the time I return, I'm likely to lose at least a hundred prisoners. So, uh, it's more... It's better to have a Ransom Broker on hand, but it's also good to have them all go to one location. That way I don't have prisoners in every bloody town. And because Dirim's my capital, it's nice and central, I go there a lot to do this and that. So I think it's uh, the best course of action to put my prisoners inside of Dirium usually. And we started at around 40,000. 35,000 dinars. Very lucrative. Nice way to get loot. Anyway, I'll go in here, talk to the lords inside and uh, tell them to go all over the map. Helmar, Nara, Kuro, Praven, Veluka. That's the places I usually tell them to go. Though since I'm intending to raid the Serenid territory, I uh, may forego that. I may forgo Helmar and Nara. Anyway, ah. I hope you enjoyed the battle. I cut away. Come back a bit later. See you then. Okay. After last time, I, uh, when I raided the, some of the Serenid territory, my witty was already raided, so I raided in my giant. Uh, sold the loot in either Amarada Barry, can't remember. Then I, uh, took a few trading goods, raided Taz Junat. Then sold the resulting loot in Tolga. Bought salt and spice and Tolga, sold it around Ichima and Nara and other places. On my journey uh, back to Dirim, I encountered Wait, did I already make war Well either before or after Sharez, I encountered No, it was after Sharez. I encountered some caravans around Barry that were owned by the Kyrgyz and demanded tribute from them. And that's when I came into conflict with the uh, Kyrgyz. They did offer me peace, but I refused. Right now, I led a few lords over here. One's fighting Despinoyan. And these almost 200 of my lords are fighting... Over 700 Kyrgyz, Dustin Khan and Isula Hatun. I'm going to jump in and help them. This is going to be hard. And I'm not martial either. I can't command their men, only my own. So, I'm going to hold back a bit. Might be the way to go. And again, these are Kyrgyz, so... Might be... I should call them in. Took a chunk out of my horse, that one did. Of course, not all of them are Kyrgyz. Ooh. <laughs> 
Good shot, whoever did that. Let me pay you back. I found that they have over 50 lances among them. Jumped. Better get closer to my men. Maybe find a new horse. Plenty of horses around. There we are. Well, we run the we won the first round. But there are more left. I suspect we killed no more than two hundred this time. Maybe only a hundred and fifty. And that would be that. I lost 10 of my men. 
They almost lost a third of theirs. Roughly. Enemy lost almost 200 of their 700. We can win. It'll be a hard fight, but we can win. I'll let my men charge in. My men don't charge, I won't charge. It's best that we act as one. And some more enemies. Great. Horse might be swayed back now, but I'm not sure. Seem to be able to keep ahead of them. I should go over to my own men. That'll lure them closer. Who's left?
with your borcha. But I wanted that kill. Alright, we only lost 30 that time. Enemy lost 150. I can live with that. 147 against 400. little cluster we have here. Hold up the cavalry. Lost to them. I'd say the battle's going rather well. Killing far more of the enemy than they are of us. Only 16 casualties. And the enemy have far more. 276 against 130. I like those odds.
mostly Kyrgyz now. Osula's 90 soldiers have been mostly eaten up, I'm sure, if not completely. And we have another victory. Five casualties. 137 for the enemy. Two more rounds, mayhaps. Two more rounds. Still a lot of lances among them, <sighs> but I can deal with that. And that would be that. Only a handful of casualties.
There it is. Alright, let's finish them off. A lot of men on foot back there. Tribesmen, I suppose. Hard to say. And it's over. We've won. You arrived just in the nick of time, Bert the Bandit King. You have my deepest thanks. And let us give thanks to the heavens for our victory and mourn the many fine men who have fallen this day. Stop. I yield. You're my prisoner now. I'm at your mercy. But the corn got away. How unfortunate. We'll take the good prisoners, if I can find any. I'm sure there are plenty. We'll get rid of the... Uh, those that sell for medium amounts. Get a little more for the sweaty and crossbowmen. There we go. And I still have 50 men. Not bad. Well, those are some nice boots. I may give those to someone. I'll tell them to go back to Dirim. Hopefully they are willing to retreat. I should have checked that before I brought them with me over here. Oh well. Anyway, I think I'm going to end it off here. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you next time. See you then.